Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Thank you for always tuning in. We appreciate you all. And for our newcomers, thank you so much for coming. You are highly welcome. Please do not forget to subscribe and hit on the bell so you'll be the first to see when we post a new video. Guys, today I'm gonna take you guys on a lab tour. It's gonna be really fun. If you've ever wondered what it is like to work as a medical laboratory scientist, stay to the end of this video and you will find out what a typical day is like for us. So who is the medical lab scientists. The medical lab scientists are highly skilled scientists that perform testing to discover the presence or absence of diseases, which in turn help the physicians with diagnosis. I'm going to be showing you guys different departments in the lab. And before we dive in, I just want to give a shout out to all our lab assistants and phlebotomists because they are in charge of collecting the specimen for us. They are basically the phase of the lab. They collect the specimen from the patient and they properly label the specimen before we can do testing on the specimen. So shout out to all lab assistants. And Quay, tell us what you do. I go to all patients' rooms, ordered by the doctors, whether they have a stat or routine labs, and I do proper blood collections. That's good. Thank you, Quay. So, um, moving on to a different department, I'm going to be showing you guys a little bit of what we do. I'm going to be showing you guys summary of what each department does. So, first, we're going to go to the chemistry department. Hey guys, welcome to the core lab. This is chemistry department. In chemistry, we test for your electrolytes, we check for heart attack, we check for kidney and liver failure, we do hormone testing, we do hepatitis testing, allergic testing, and diabetes testing. And we're gonna move on to the next. This department is hematology. Here is hematology. In hematology, we test your complete blood count, meaning your white blood cells, red blood cells, your platelet, and so forth, to determine if you have anemia, infections, or cancer, or any kind of bleeding. So yeah, with hematology, we are able to know if you need blood, if you need like blood transfusion. We are able to know that. So now we're gonna move on to the next department, which is the urinalysis. Urinalysis section is where we screen your urine sample for evidence of kidney disease or urinary tract infection or maybe diabetes. So urine pregnancy test and urine drug screen is performed in this department as well. Yeah, we moving on to the next department. Next is the coagulation department. Coagulation is where we perform procedure to identify possible bleeding or clotting disorders. If you have any clotting, you know, disorders, we are able to detect it in this very department. So our next department is going to be the microbiology department. Welcome to microbiology. This is where we grow bacteria. This is where we're doing the COVID testing. And this is where we do isolation, identification, and sensitivity to determine any microorganisms in all body fluids, tissues, and blood cultures, and bone marrow. The final department I'm going to be talking about today is blood bank where transfusion is being done. This is a very critical department because if you made any mistake, you can kill somebody. If you cross match incompatible blood, you know, you can kill somebody instantly. Anyways, this is where we do the ABO testing to know your blood type, if you're A positive, B positive, O positive, and we also do compatibility testing, antibody identification, we investigate abnormalities such as hemolytic disease of the newborn. All right, guys, we've come to the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching to the end. If you want to choose this career path, I will highly recommend it if you're interested because you're going to love it. You're going to have fun. You're going to love the fact that you're able to know what is going on in a human body before any other person gets to know. Thank you so much. <laughs> Bye.